Matt is super Catholic. Does that? <laughs> That's okay. Super or super Catholic? Yeah, he's super Catholic. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Does that? Are you spiritual in any way? Yeah, I mean, I grew up Catholic, um, and uh, I actually um, a, a, a few years ago I played a priest in a film, and so right. I was, I, you know, I did a lot of research for that, and and um, and so that you know I was able to draw upon that experience uh, um, when approaching this role. Um, uh, and it's it's a great thing. Um, to have to have in a character from an acting point of view, because you get to you know you you get to to play that inner conflict you know with with you know what he, what he believes is right and what he's doing and and, and, and how that they and those things don't always necessarily go hand in hand and and um, one of the things I love about the show is that we get to see what it feels like when you when you sit with yourself mm -hmm. you know we really in, in in Daredevil I don't know if you notice but some of the scenes are very long you really you really live in a scene you really feel the the the, the scene whether it's one person thinking or two people talking, it doesn't matter. And, um, and uh, you know, I'm, that's an area that I'm, of human nature I'm always interested in, is how do, how, what do people th think and feel? How do they react? How do they act when, when the lights go off or when, when the door shuts and they're left alone at the end of the night? You know? Deborah, um, Karen seems to be the brains of the operation. She's like <laughs> a thinking person in um, Nelson and, and Murdoch. Mm -hmm. Do you agree? Um, I think she's, she's one of the brains. I think, you know, you're talking about three very intelligent people. I think, I think what I think Karen has is kind of the, like the chutzpah, the kind of, she has the go get him attitude. Yeah, it's Yiddish. Word. Chutzpah. Um, but yeah, that, you know, that, that if, um, like, actually one thing that makes me sort of laugh towards the end of the, the season, I like how, because Karen doesn't know that Matt is Daredevil, she thinks he's kind of a stick in the mud. She's kind of like, you need to be doing more. We need to be working around the law. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and yeah. It's like, if she only knew what Matt were doing yeah, after hours, right. she wouldn't yell at him. Yeah. But I like that she feels like she's the one who's like, no, push the boundaries. No, it's not mm. much in the way of repayment, but it is, um, my grandmother's recipe, and she made me promise only to serve it to my future husband. Wow. You know, it's like filled with virtue or something. I thought I detected a whiff of virtue in there. Not that I'm complaining, but you really should be thanking the nut in the mask. He's not a nut. I mean, he's a little weird. Oh, maybe. we're just glad you're okay. Here, here. Well, if it weren't for you two, I'd still be in that cell. Job's easy when your client's innocent. All you did was tell the truth. <laughs>